Hello and welcome to CNCF Minutes. In this video, we'll be discussing about Captain. Captain is a CNCF sandbox project. It is cloud native application lifecycle orchestration. So it is event driven, event based control plane for continuous delivery and automated operations. Now, what does that mean? So before that, let's understand why Captain was introduced. Now, there were a lot of manual tasks that were happening within the organizations. There were a lot of manual remediations that were happening. So like if anything goes wrong, then there has to be manual scripts that have to be triggered. And a lot of pipelines, a lot of long pipelines were getting maintained. Now with Captain, the goal is no pipeline code and everything is event based. Now say from a Prometheus metrics, there is an alert which is getting triggered. So on that particular configuration, you can have your scripts running and which will auto heal or auto remediate the particular issue like scaling or something else. And Captain has a very declarative approach, which is very small configuration files, which is defined for all the stages, dev stage production. Now, what are the different use cases? So Captain comes with built in observability dashboards and alerting. Now, this means that whenever the application is onboarded, not deployed yet, but it is still onboarded, with Captain, now it, you can automatically create the basic dashboards at alerting mechanism on top of it. Second is SLO driven multi-stage delivery. So this means whenever a new release is getting out, so you can check it against the previous release, whether this particular release is having a uh, good, better response time than the previous one and the other things. So this is defined in a file called slo.yaml. Operations and remediation. So it will automate all the SRE operations and the auto remediation based on events, alerts, and all that. So these are the major features of Captain. Declarative automation. So everything is in a declarative config file. It is GitOps based. As soon as you commit the code in GitHub, everything gets triggered for all the environments, dev stage production. SLO driven, you can evaluate the new release with respect to previous based on the SLOs and closed loop remediation so you can remediate according to events that gets triggered standard based interoperability so this is very critical feature so you can use your existing tooling and integrate with captain so you can see the current integrations you can have uh, integration with jenkins you can have uh, helm charts getting deployed integration with argo uh, litmus so all these integrations are there and the integrations are getting built as well so if you see on a very high level, this particular architecture, which we have not discussed yet. So you can see there is a config update and then you deploy, test, evaluate. These are the different stages. So you can see that Captain is the autom autonomous control plane, which handles or orchestrates all the delivery of the application. And these are the different environments where the application gets deployed. And it is standard tooling, which is built in. Alerting mechanisms is there and running on Kubernetes as well. So this is how the captain UI looks like. And this is a sample application that has been defined across different stages, dev stage production. And uh, these are the different configurations which have been defined in the shipyard.yaml file. Deployment test evaluation, get CLI release. And if we go to the shipyard.yaml, you can see we have deployment, uh, test, evaluation, release. So all these sequences are there, which will run one by one. And you can also see the slo.yaml file. So it checks for the response time and it passes based on some criteria. And then you also have integrations. Uh, there are There is extensive documentation for the integration. This one is for Jenkins. So how to integrate Jenkins with Captain. And uh, this is the documentation which explains you briefly about what it is, how it works, and this is the GitHub repository. So that's a very high level overview of what Captain is. And if you want more deep dive, then put in the comment box. So like, subscribe, share the video, and thank you for watching.